Does anybody know what the worst airline is in the world? Delta? What else? Air India? So of course it's a trick question. It's whichever airline you happen to be on. Because they all stink, don't they? I mean, terrible service. You feel like you're trapped. You know, they eat the same horrible peanuts. It's awful. It's a lousy experience. And then let's face it, airlines tell their story identically. I mean, they're basically indistinguishable. You don't even care which airline you're on at some point. Like, sometimes you could forget. Except if you happen to be in South Africa. And you happen to be on Kalula Airlines. Here's a picture of a Kalula Airline airplane. <laughs> now, Kalula has some personality. They don't take themselves too seriously, and they have some fun with it. You can see they do some cool things with their planes. Shows you the nose cone, you got the radar antenna and a really big dish inside. So they're having fun, they're being cool, they're being very different. Now you'd say, all right, are they telling their story just like some weird guys in the paint shop got a little nuts? No, their story is, is authentic and consistent throughout their entire organization. The flight attendants, for example, say some interesting things on the PA, over the PA. So here's a couple actual things heard on Kalula Airlines. Thank you for flying Kalula. We hope you enjoyed giving us the business as much as we enjoyed taking you for a ride. Kalula Airlines is pleased to announce that we have some of the best flight attendants in the industry. Unfortunately, none of them are on this flight. My favorite, ladies and gentlemen, if you wish to smoke, the smoking section is on the wing. If you can light them, you can smoke them. <laughs> Totally different, right? So I want you to think, whether you're pitching to a VC or hiring or pitching yourself to get hired, think about how you're telling your story. And if there's a way that you can, can, can craft it in a creative way, a way that you can stand out as a category of one, that will make all the difference. I've literally hired thousands of people in Southeast Michigan over the last 15 plus years. And if I see another resume that looks exactly like everybody else's, you know, they just move right past you. But if someone stands out, if someone's different and compelling, maybe someone gives you an unresume. I mean, the more creative you can tell your story, the better your results are going to be.